What is up guys? Welcome to another app review and this app is for a little game called Kingdoms Live. Now Kingdoms Live is pretty similar to this iMobsters if you ever played that before. And I even think it's made by the same company. I'm not entirely sure. But this is a free app and again it's one of those apps that is very addicting. So it starts out on this Kingdoms Live screen and go ahead and close this. Ooh, nice. I found a chest. Not bad. And go ahead and click no thanks to this little ad. And now, how you start out, you got a bunch of buttons that you probably don't know what anything means, and that's what I'm going to be going over today. Now, the probably most important thing is this quest right here. Now, before I do that, you see, we also, it's one of those games that you can level up by getting more experience and moving to the next level. So go ahead and you can do this, get experience by doing quests. Now, quests pretty much are, let you earn gold, which is the money, and experience gold lets you spend stuff obviously and experience lets you level up so how you do a quest is just go scroll to the quest and click do it so then you have more quests and you unlock them as you level up um, another cool thing is battle which I just call fighting and this is actual other people that are playing the game right now I'm on Wi-Fi so that's everyone who's playing the game now the winner of the fight let's see I, I attack this guy who's a level 2 and I lost so how do you decide who wins and loses? Well, the winner is based on the size of your army, which I'll be talking about later, and everyone in your army, their equipment, and their spells, and their attack and defense attributes. But we'll be going over that in the later. Um, let's see what else we can go over. Uh, armory, right here. These are your like quick little keys at the bottom. Your armory is pretty much how you can buy weapons and armor, and this will help with your fighting and battles and spells those help as well so you get more options as you can see I only have like three spells right now you get more options as you level up you can see I'm only level four right now because I'm a noob and you guys are probably gonna pwn me but anyways that's how you do that now let's go ahead and go back home and let's go to my profile right here now what your profile is is pretty much an overview of your character and you can also like spend points here you can look at your skills, um, the loot or the stuff you stole from other people. And, you know, it, it's just your profile. I didn't really even need to go into that, but you know what? I did, so oh well. Now, the army thing I was talking about is very important. It depends how much, how strong you are when you go into fights. The bigger army you have, the more likely you are to win fights. And if you want to join my army, my code is 2XT89G. So just go ahead and... Pop that in there and press invite and then you'll be in my army and the more people that we get to join the more likely we're going to win fights because our army is stronger. Right now you see I just got this game so army size of 1. So that's pretty embarrassing so I'm just going to exit out of that and hopefully you didn't see that. And the one of the last things I want to talk about, well I'll talk about a few other things. Land is one of my favorite aspects of the game. This are pretty much investments that you can buy and you earn a steady income right now you see I only got one gold coming in every you know so often but the more land you buy then the more pretty much income you'll get in well that's pretty much it no need to talk any further about that but that's what I like about this that you can keep earning gold even when you're you know sleeping even when you're at work or anything like that the game still keeps going on so aside from that uh, let's go over the vault right here now, whenever you get attacked and you're not online, well, or if you are online, people can take your money when they attack you. Pretty mean, I know, but it's pretty fun. And what you can do is put your money in a vault and that keeps it safe from attackers. So if you know you're going to sign off and you have a bunch of money, make sure to put it in the vault and that way they can't get to it. So the last thing I want to talk to you guys about, the less important thing, is this agents right here. Now the agents, you get legends points just from doing random stuff playing the game. They award them to you. What agents does is pretty much um, gives you a variety of services you can do. Like you get uh, 200 gold if you spend 10 points. You can also change your name, reset your character, and a whole bunch of other stuff like that. Or you can buy it from the company, of course, um, points or gold or whatever. But I mean, aside from that, what you do is pretty much... Um, keep doing quests, keep leveling up, unlocking stuff, building your army, 
and it's actually a really fun game even though I just started. Again, like I said, a lot similar to High School Superstar and iMobsters type feeling. But I like these type of games a lot since you can just pretty much keep playing them forever. And aside from that, it is free 100%. Um, that's why I'm giving this game an 8 out of 10 rating. Because you know what? It really never gets old if you don't want it to until you get sick of it. So, you know, that's all I have for this tutorial. Or, excuse me, review. If you want... To, uh, if you want me to review any more apps, then just go ahead and leave a comment on this video right here of what app you want me to review, and I'll do it for you. It doesn't matter if it's a paid app or a free app or what. I'll review it for you. And aside from that, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.